Remember that readers are often expected to draw inferences, conclusions which are strongly supported by a passage, even if they're not explicitly stated. Sometimes, these inferences take the form of new details consistent with the passage. In other words, statements with which the author would probably agree. In order to correctly make these inferences, we need to have an awareness of the main idea, tone, and purpose of the passage. Let's look at an example. We want to know with which statements, and we'll present two after we read the passage, would the author of this passage most likely agree? So, here's the passage. The No Child Left Behind Act of 2001 mandates that all students reach proficiency in mathematics and reading by 2014. Schools that operate with a charter may have the best chance of making data-driven reforms a reality. In charter schools, autonomous board members can make decisions quickly. Compared with most traditional schools, they can more easily fire staff who are not performing up to par. So let's consider the main idea, attitude, and purpose of this passage. The main idea is that charter schools have a good chance of making reforms because they have more freedoms. The tone, or attitude, is that this author is sort of optimistic regarding charter schools. And the purpose of the passage is to explain why charter schools should be able to make these reforms. Keeping that in mind, let's look at this statement. Traditional schools are prevented from making reforms by their lack of autonomy. This seems to more or less line up with what the author is saying which is that charter schools with more autonomy are able to make better reforms or are more able to make reforms. So this is a valid inference. Let's look at another one. Traditional schools do not care about data-driven reforms or student proficiency. This inference deals with what traditional schools care about, their priorities. This is not a subject that's discussed in the passage, and so this inference is invalid. It doesn't match our main idea, tone, or purpose.